Hi, Toaster here from Aussie 8. We've embarked on a 25,000 plus kilometre figure eight lap of, a, of Australia, this great continent of ours. We decided the best way to show that we had done this figure eight was would be to charge our Tesla electric vehicle at charging points that are on the uh, continental extremes of the continent, so the most northerly point, the most easterly point, the most southerly point, etc., etc., and also a point in the centre of Australia, because with the figure eight we have to go through the centre twice. Those of us with EVs swear by this app or website called PlugShare. It lists most of the public charging points around the world. Uh, as you can see in this view, it makes it seem like the world is covered in charging points. But when you zoom in a bit, especially into like the remote parts of Australia, you can see that um, they're not always that close together, and some of them are you know, two, three hundred kilometers apart. So of all of these charge points in Australia, which ones will signify those continental extremes? Well, we first have to go to the Geosciences Australia website, and they have this page for continental extremities, and it lists the most northerly, easterly, southerly, both mainland and continental, and westerly points in Australia. So for example, Cape York would be the most northerly. So the idea is we will map charge points to as close as we can to those extremities. For the centre of Australia, Geosciences website has this page and there have been a number of different methods used over the years to calculate the centre of Australia. Obviously it's not a perfect circle, um, so there are different methods. The most recent is this Lambert gravitational center method um, which was done for the Australian bicentenary in 1988 and it determined that the center of Australia is a location called Fink which is in southern northern territory about 200 kilometers south of Alice Springs. So for our endeavor we've come up with a few rules. Um, first of all the charge site must be listed on PlugShare and by a third party. Um, we, you know we could probably find power points more, more northerly or maybe more easterly than the ones listed and kind of create our own which is actually what people do on PlugShare because it's a crowdsource app um, but I, to be fair we will pick sites that have been created by others not by ourselves they must also be accessible by two-wheel drive um, for the central parts of Australia there are actually some that are only accessible by four-wheel drive and again they need to be the most northerly westerly central, easterly and southerly, both for mainland and Tasmania, as listed on PlugShare when we pass through. So here is the northernmost part of Australia, Cape York, but as you can see there is very, there is in fact no charging infrastructure at the tip. So we'll have to move over to Darwin here, which seems to have the most northerly charge point. If we zoom in, we can see that it is the Darwin Hospital, at the northern end of town and it has a type 2 charger in the public car park. So we will check in here as proof that we've gone to the most northerly point of Australia from a charging perspective. For the easterly extremity of Australia it is the Byron Bay Lighthouse. So if we zoom in here on Byron Bay as you can see there's quite a few listings there's one in particular here that's the most easterly as the time of recording, which is this uh, Airbnb listing, the Marvel Lane Studio. So hopefully we can uh, rent this out and check in. Um, it seems to have a Tesla wall connector. For the most southerly on the mainland, uh, the point is Wilson's Promontory in Victoria. So if we zoom in, there is a listing here for the Tidal River campground. So this will be your typical campground charging setup. So either 15 amp sockets or 10 amp sockets. So we will hopefully be able to check in here. For the most southerly for the continent, uh, that would be in southern Tasmania. There is a town called Heinth. Hopefully that's how you pronounce it, near Bruni Island. And it has a listing at a cafe called Rocket at the end of the road. And they have a Type 2 connector.
for the most westerly point. The location listed on the Geosciences website was near Shock Bay, uh, so near this peninsula here. And it looks like the westerly most charging point is in the town called Denham. If we zoom in, it would be this listing here, which is the Denham Caravan Park. And this would have your typical 15 amp, uh, 10 amp charging setup. To mark us going through the centre of Australia, we will use that Lambert centre point, which is near the location called Fink, uh, which is highlighted here near the cursor. There is a charging point to the east, a hotel. It's a listing that has no check-ins, and we, after further research, this is only accessible by four-wheel drive. Uh, so our two-wheel two drive will not make it. So we'll have to pick this site here, which is the Colgera Pub, uh, which is to the west of Fink, um, as our check-in. And they have a three-phase uh, socket, um, which would be fine for us to use. So that's the plan, to check in to the locations listed on screen. Uh, we'll use uh, PlugShare check-in, so you can see us there under the name Aussie 8. Uh, if you have any questions or comments about our plan, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.